Saturday, September 30th. Talking to the USC and Colorado, all kinds of hype and all kinds of primetime stuff about this. Uh, let's bring in our guy, Tim Earl from Earl Sports Bets. Tim, this game has got all the talk in the world about it because of the coach from the from uh, Colorado here, and rightfully so. Yeah. Great coach, doing his thing, whatever. But the USC Trojans are the real deal. Minus 21 and a half, traveling to Colorado, take on those Buffaloes. The over-under sits at a whopping 73 and a half. And don't think your boy is not tempted to take the over. Uh, but, uh, Tim, tell them what you like in this game. Well, I will say um, I was – I got it very, very early. Uh, I decided to bet this game at the halftime of the Oregon game. And I got 17 and a half. But I'm still taking USC at minus 21 and a half. We finally, finally have seen what this Colorado team is when they actually go up against a good team. Oregon ran all over them. They threw all over them, and they played, and, and Colorado couldn't do anything on offense. So you, amazing what happens when their best receiver goes down. Travis Hunter is out for the next couple of weeks, and he, he's out in the worst timing for Colorado because they go up against their toughest opponents. The thing is, I look at this one. USC, better offensive team than Oregon. And, and, and I know it's probably a little bit close, but they're the better offensive team uh, USC defense, not as good as, as Oregon. So Colorado will score in this game, but it won't matter when USC drops 60 on them alone. Uh, I, I do think this game goes over. I do think this game goes over, but I am going to grab USD minus 21 and a half. I got 17 and a half. I don't think it matters when they win by 35. So, uh, we're going to be grabbing USC to absolutely just hand it to Colorado again. Cause I don't see anything different. Yeah. I, um, uh... I actually got the uh, I got this at 19 and a half, so I was happy to get it right under 20. But it's climbing, and I I, I don't it it can keep climbing. I'm gonna keep get, keep keep taking it here. I think USC dominates them, throws a 50 spot on them, at maybe least. 60. Uh, you know I I'm worried actually about the over because I need Colorado to get a little bit. I'm not worried about Colorado scoring against USC. And it's only because look what USC's defense has done. Oh, they're horrible. 26 against San Jose State, 14 against Nevada, 10 against Stanford, fine. 28 against Arizona State. Um, yeah. yeah, no, th this is a USC defense that is going to allow points. Oregon's defense is a lot better. That's why they yeah, were able to do what they did. Colorado will be able to score, especially at home. But when it comes to it, I don't. It's going to be tough for Colorado to keep up with USC when they put up fifty-five to sixty points. I love it there. Don't forget, uh, you guys. Tim's got a new promo going on right now. Head over to picksandparlays.net slash Tim for all sports week pass, all sports, all week, seven day pass here, seventy dollars. See what he's doing there. Seven days, seventy bucks. See what he gets. There's a lot of thought that went into that, so you're welcome. Uh, check this out, though. Yeah, don't look at my hands. Just look at the promo. Uh, Picksandparlays.net slash Tim. All sports pass. Uh, week pass for $70. Mention this video. Uh, mention the hands. Do whatever. Get in there. You get all that. So get in there. Change. Uh, get yourself some deals right there. Don't forget, Tim says, free pick for today. USC Trojans minus 21 and a half. Tim Earl, Earl Sports Bets. We appreciate you. I'm Detroit Lenny Picks and Parlays. Good luck. Unless you're against us. Take care.